So I'm back. Uh, what happened was, I wonder if I can edit that. So anyways, what happened was, uh, I almost ran the red light. I didn't almost run a red light. I like to, uh, it's like when I noticed somebody, when I, like, I noticed something about somebody when I was watching them the other day, I was listening to them, you know, uh, one of my, um, one of the, um, you know, one of my resources, whatever you want to call it, you know what I'm saying, about whatever it is, you know what I'm saying, it could be a resource of anything, you know what I'm saying, it could be a resource of uh, happiness, it could be a resource of uh, education, it could be resources of uh, some kind of knowledge, it could be a resource of love, it could be any kind of resource, so I read one of my resources, and uh, uh, so I noticed, like, and I, I guess I kind of got the same to deal too, like, and I'm noticing too, I'm on my own, like, uh, Like when I be talking or something, or when this person was talking or whatever, like I noticed when they had something very, very important to say, and it was like the hundred percent truth, they like, they like doubted it. They, they they didn't doubt it, but they would they would say I don't know or like you know like 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 they were unsure of it. But you know, so that's one thing. You know, you know that's, that's not that's not a red flag or nothing. That's just a. That's just a, something that like like a, a green yellow flag, <laughs> green yellow flag. Nah, man, I just wanted to show you how the view tonight, man. I just came out here, I had some, I had some energy, and uh, I might as well just come out here and, and show you some, show you what it looks like. Let's see if I, can, if I got it right. Hopefully, it's recording. Okay. And um, so yeah, that's all I wanted to do. Show you how it is. You know, it's a beautiful night. You know, it's a beautiful night. And um. So I might go back around because I got the camera all, all, all over the place. This is um, Cesar Chavez. There are no cops around. But one of the one of the things I do to release is I like to go drive around, drive around, and then uh, hopefully I don't, you know, try not to get no road rage or nothing like that. And uh, usually by that I got a fast car, so usually I either out smoke them out, burn them, they can bite my dust, or. Um, or I chill out, I'm like, okay, okay, can I let them go, and stuff like that, you know. I'm talking about, some, you know, sometimes you gotta get breaks, you know what I'm saying, you can't always be a butthole, you can't always be the fastest one, sometimes you gotta, you know, you got an older, uh, elderly, you know what I'm saying, and they're, you know what I'm saying, they're not being buttholes, they're just elderly, even if they are being buttholes, you know what I'm saying, they're elderly, you like, you still gotta respect them, you still, there's still a protocol to, to live by, you know what I'm saying, like, I'm, I'm middle aged or whatever, I'm 37. If, he's, if I see like a 70 year old, 75 year old, man or a woman is struggling on the street or something, like in the way or something, like I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to either wait in my car, you know what I'm saying? Don't try to, no, don't be a butthole and stuff like that. Make sure he makes it. And if he doesn't make it, get out the car and help him. You know, or if I'm walking, of course, I'm gonna help, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna help. So, this is Fifth Street. Oops, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> well, so. I guess I need to take off the glasses. Hey, dude, you're going the wrong way. <laughs> you're going the wrong way. Hey. So, yeah, I'm a little quirky right now, whatever, quirky, whatever. Uh, however you want to call it, I really don't care. But, um, but yeah, man, just uh, stay true to yourself. Always do you. And, uh, there's important things you got to do. You got to, you got to, you got to spread that love. You got to spread an unconditional love in all your relationships. And and if you got people that are bringing you down and and, and taking away from your energy, you got to realize that's no good. And you got to realize you got to do something about that. Otherwise, it's going to take away from your happiness, and you're not going to be happy. So you got to make decisions that are going to make you happy. <sighs> Otherwise, you're not going to be happy. And I tell these people all the time, man. I tell them to make sure. Say, are you happy? Are you happy? Yeah, I do it for this. Do it for that. Dude. Yeah, but do you do it for yourself? You know, are you doing it for yourself? You know, like. You know, if you're not happy, if mama's not happy, or daddy, whatever, you know, nobody you know, has a thing called, if mama's not happy, then nobody's happy, you know? So, um, so, you know, just make sure you're making decisions that make you happy, you know what I'm saying? No matter what it is, you know what I'm saying? If you're making little decisions that, that, that don't make you happy, it's going to chip away from your happiness. It's going to keep chipping away, chipping away from your happiness. And, uh, you know, you don't want to really, really do that. You want to have your happiness. Let's see if I can take a left right here. Uh, yes, I believe so. Uh, let's see. Let me take off the glasses for a little bit because it might be a cop. And it is. It was a cop. So you know, I'm waiting on this person. Now, oh, sorry. Be careful. I 
I should, I'm trying to turn on my screen because my screen's really, really bright right now.